Happy Sunday, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, coming at you with 2021 Panini Contenders Football. Three box, pick your team, number three. With $1,000 of break credit being given away. So if you follow the instructions here, if you bought at least two teams in the break, blah, 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 get those entries. Top two names will win $500 of break credit each. Also, no vet common ship in this. Big thanks to all of these wonderful people for getting in on the action. 2021 Panini Contenders Football. Three box number three. Three box pick your team three. Now let's select a die. Let's select that one right there. And we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll. One, two, right there. And then we'll save these for next time. All right, and we're looking for five autographs per box on average. All right, good luck, everybody. I think the next three box break um, only has a couple teams left. So if someone buys those two teams, they'll get an entry for some break credit, or a chance at break credit. Just basically by an even number of teams. Two teams, one entry, four teams gets you two entries, six teams get you three entries, so on and so forth. All right, now in addition to some hits, but one hit's gonna be replaced by those 400 points. We're gonna randomize those points as one lot to one person in the, uh, in the break. There's Cameron McGrone, Patriots, that's gonna be for Mike. We'll do left-right randomizers for those guys as well. We've got Jameen Davis, rookie ticket autograph for the Commanders. And it'll be for Aaron and Washington. Got Amon Ross St. Brown, rookie ticket on card autograph. That's for Riley and the Lions. There's Warren Sapp, power players insert to 99. It's a great photo there. Buccaneers, that's going to be for Daisuke. Uh, I'll leave those over here. And we've got a little bend here, but a Davion Nixon. I should flatten that out a little bit. That goes to Anthony and Carolina. Box. Got the, got the sounds of the Phillies at Dodgers on the background. Top of the eighth, Dodgers down. Two couple runs to the Phillies. We've been playing some pretty great baseball. Gene Segura having a great year. Bryce Harper playing great. If that bullpen kind of tightens up a little bit, that could be a dangerous team.
So, I think the win totals, I think we're, uh, I think the line was adjusted last week, at least according to DraftKings May 6, about a week ago. I don't, I'm sure the odds haven't really changed too much then. They have the Buccaneers and Bills at both 11 and a half wins. Buccaneers, Bills, 11 and a half wins. What does everyone have there? Over or under? Remember, don't forget, we added that 17th game last year. Tim has Bills over. Yeah, I'll, have to take, I'll have to take a peek at their schedule, but the 12 games shouldn't be too difficult. There's Derek Carr, my Raiders, 99 out of 199. What does everyone think about my Raiders? If there's any neutral fans out there, Raiders win total seems a little low at 8.5. Eight and a half, eight, Dra DraftKings has them at eight and a half. Although well, that's pretty similar market wide. Uh, there is Jonathan Cooper for my rivals, the Broncos. That's going to be for Joshua. Good okay. for the Packers. Eric Stokes, rookie ticket autograph for Green Bay. That'll be for Allen. Tim also says over for the Raiders, over the eight and a half. And speaking of the Raiders, there's Trayvon Morg, rookie auto for the Raiders. If he takes it another step forward in his evolution as a player, that'd be that'd be good news for the Raiders defense. That's gonna go to Jose and the Raiders. Steve Locke also saying over for the Raiders. I think they got I, I glanced at their schedule and did like a quick win-loss kind of thing. Nothing too in-depth, but at a glance, I, thought, I, I saw 10 wins. And we've got a Buccaneer. We got Joe Tryon Shoyinka, 84 out of 99 for Tampa Bay. That will be for Daisuke. What are, what are the other teams in the division have? Chiefs at 10.5 wins, Broncos at 10 wins, Chargers at 10 wins, and then Raiders at 8.5 wins. Wow. Hmm. So according to win totals, Raiders are going to be last. I don't think that's going to happen. It is, it is a tough division. NJ saying uh, Rams repeat. There's Cooper Cup right there. He'll be a big reason why if they do. Here's a redemption. Uh, Rams win total at 10.5. I feel like that's a tough division too. All right, redemption is Trey Sermon. Rookie ticket variation RPS for the Niners. Niners win total at 10. Rams win total at ten and a half. That's, a, that's already that's that's pretty tough. Cardinals win total at nine. All right. Once again, Joshua with the Niners. Yeah. In this day and age, I think in almost any sport, it's tough to repeat. Yeah, I like I like the I like playing the Lions this year, Tim. Lot of a uh, lot of one score losses last year. You know, some of them within a field goal. If they turn some of those some of those one score losses into into Ws, which could easily happen with a little bit of luck, I think they could do it. Their win total is at six and a half. I'm not very good at playing totals, but. Maybe this year I'll, I'll experiment with it, but 
They're at six and a half. I, I think I think that sounds about right, but I think they could, a little luck, maybe get seven wins out of there. But six, seven wins sounds about right. Joe P, what's going on? Yeah, less than an hour than your sons. Suns game seven. Are you nervous? Yeah, it is still Jared Goff, but, but you know, they have a great offensive line. And if that gives Jared Goff some time, that's all, that's all Jared Goff needs to be a decent quarterback. Now, once he gets like flushed out and he has, doesn't have enough time, then, you know, then that's, that's where it starts to get a little tricky, but. But yeah, well, I mean, like I said, look at look at last year's schedule and look how just don't look at the win loss record. Look at last year's schedule and just see how close they were. You know, they were maybe a score away or a defensive play away from from uh, from turn from from getting a lot more wins than you would think. There's Kyle Trask for the Buccaneers. Joe P, we got a we got a Revolution basketball game, uh, basketball game, basketball break coming up after this, and we'll be discussing a lot of uh, a lot of that game in that break. Sixty one out of ninety nine, Lamar Jackson, Steve Locks Vikings. What's your according to ActionNetwork.com, and they're using lines from DraftKings Sportsbook. Your Vikings win total at nine. What do you think? Speaking of the Vikings, here's rookie ticket autograph at Cameron Bynum. That is a blue parallel, but not number. It's definitely a parallel. There's no numbering. Still cool. That goes to Joshua and the Vikings. We got Sean Wade. Steve Locke, Vikings fan, thinks nine's about the right number. Let's see. We're, let's see where your rivals, the Packers, are sitting. Packers are at about 11 wins, according to DraftKings. They'll have the Vikings, I think, at second place with nine wins, according to the, just going by win totals. Bears, six and a half. Lions, six and a half. Ooh, a 1-1 game for the Dodgers. There you go, Lux. Lux scoring and got on base somehow, making up for those errors. All right. We got uh, Talana Hufanga, rookie ticket autograph. Or Talan, sorry, I'm butchering this name. Talanoa Hufanga. And he is, uh, was drafted by the Niners, still with the Niners. That's another redemption for Joshua. There's Tillon Wallace, rookie ticket autograph. 11, Steve Locke thinks 11's a little too high for the pack. Ooh, Steve Birch saying Vikings have one of the easiest schedules this year. So maybe, maybe 10 wins? Aaron Billingsley with Baltimore. Be more. The Purple Birds, the Ravens. And that, that's that, my friends. So we got some randomizing to do here, so let's take care of that. So let's go, and no, I did not see the Chargers anime style release schedule this this week, release schedule video. 
All right, so let's flip back to the list. First of all, everyone has a shot at the points. That's 400 points to the name on top. And then we got a left-right randomizer. Let's separate that out. We got a left-right randomizer for those round number cards. And now, let's see who bought, who followed the instructions. Let's sort by your first names. If you buy at least an even number of teams, half of those become entries for break credit. There's Aaron with two, that's one entry. Alan with two, that's an entry. Anthony with two, that's an entry. Corey with two, that's an entry. Daisuke gets four, that's two entries. Jose with two, that's an entry. Uh, Josh with eight, so that's four entries. Justin with two, that's an entry. Mike with two, that's an entry. Oliver with two, that's an entry. Riley with two, that's an entry. And Sean Maddock with two, that's an entry. I think every single person bought an even number of teams. That's great, thank you. Let me just spot check this again really quick. So we got Sean, Riley, Oliver, Mike. Justin, Josh, Jose, Daisuke, Corey, Anthony, Alan, and Aaron. All right, so that's two and 16 are gonna get $500 of break credit each. All right, let's roll it, randomize it. Uh, all three lists will be randomized a full 12 times. Let's do the left, right first. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelfth and final time. After twelve times, the left side cards will get them. So all the left side teams will get these round number cards. All right, twelve times again. This time, name on top for the points: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, and 12th and final time. And after 12 times, that's you, Mike. 400 points going your way. Right back there. All right, now 12 times for this list right here. Top two, after 12, 500 bucks each. Spot one, spot two, 500 bucks each. Uh, break credit to jazbeescasebreaks.com. Two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and good luck. Fingers crossed. Twelfth and final time. After twelve, it's Josh and Anthony. Congrats to the both of you. Sorry, Oliver, just on the outside looking in, but thanks for getting in, man. Uh, top two though, five hundred bucks each. We'll send that to you to you, your emails. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye bye.